Hello there. Welcome to La Loopsy News. Today we're here to interview the one and the only Ace Fenderbender. So, Ace. Yes? Why are you British? Um, what do you mean, why am I British? That's like saying, why is your room all purpley? Because I like the color lavender. Well, I'm British because my mum, she's from Paris, and my dad is Australian. But... Paris is in France and Australia. I am British, yes. Um, okay, and another question is, um, how did you decide that you were going to be a mechanic? What inspired you? Well, my dad, he worked at a car shop, and he taught me how to do everything, and by the time I was three years old, I could do, well, everything. And so I opened up my own car shop when I graduated high school, and I worked on it. But then one day, it caught fire, and this lady threw her tire in the window, and everything died, and so, <laughs> I was a hobo. Wow, that's a surprisingly dark story. I know. What happened to the lady that threw the tire in the window? Oh, I don't know about her. All I know is that she's been throwing tires ever since. Oh, well, what happened to my sister hobo? Oh, what happened to it? It's dead. Mainly because I moved to La Loopsy Land, but those times before that were very rough. I don't like to talk about it. Oh, well, what happened when you moved to La Loopsy Land? Uh, Ace, are you okay? I wish I was, but I'm not. I'm never okay. Why? What's wrong? Hmm. I suppose I should... Oh, dear. Do you know? Do you want to know who I met as soon as I walked into La Loopsy Land? Um, Crumbs? No! Um, Marina? I wish, but no. Squibbles or Matey? No, Matey wasn't even alive yet. Oh, well, who was it? Spot! Santa Rosa! <laughs> Get away from me, you creep! Yes, it was her. Acey, wacey. Uh, uh, you creep. I'm sorry. It was her. Oh, and is that what started the whole infatuation with Acey, wacey? Ah. Uh, yes, it was. Oh, and why do you think she likes you? I have no idea. Maybe it's because I'm the only, um, male in the Nanoopsy, um, land who, um, is over age and not a toddler, and I honestly cannot tell you why she likes me. It's a war! Hello there, Spot. What's up, Chicken Dance? Can you tell us why you love Icy Racy? Yes. Uh. Well, he's so cute! Look at him! Uh, and, and, like, um, he's like, um, I don't know, he has like fire! It's my hair. Yeah, he's a ginger, and gingers have no souls! What? What did you just say? Gingers have no souls? That is the stupidest thing I have ever heard, much like you! What? You stupid. <laughs> no, I'm not. You're amazing and awesome and smart. I love you. Um, do you want me to leave so you can... <laughs> no, you're mom. Chicken dance. <clears throat> I am sorry for that. I don't... I don't know what just happened. Julie. There she is. I don't know what happened. Um, that was insane. I'm sorry, but it always gets like this. Every single time. Always gets insane. Are you alright? Yes, I just... I... Uh, that was... That was, I know! It was very... Traumatizing. I understand your pain. Oh, and a question about Julie. Yes? I heard that she was the magnificent Julie and she could talk. Oh, yes, she can. Why isn't she talking now? Well, she's a little... The camera shy, and she just doesn't really like to talk around others that she doesn't really know. Well, she knows me plenty well. Oh, well, you know, she just doesn't, doesn't know you. It takes a little bit to, um, get to be acquainted with her. And how did you, um, 
meet her or anything? Did you like Lucy? Um, and how did you meet Julie? Well, I um was in the jungle one day fixing a um prehistoric car. What? <laughs> I know, it's very silly. Prehistoric car, it's in a bunch of rocks. <laughs> but yes, I had to do that. One of the lowest times of my life, besides <laughs> besides that. Anyways, I was fixing the car when I saw this monkey standing there. She looked very hungry and cold, so I fed her, gave her a warm bed, and then the next thing I knew, she was attached to me like glue. Actually, it took a little while for her to pry off. I had to use school glue to do it, but, you know, it was all fine. Oh, and how did she develop her talking ability? Do you know that at all? No. All I know is that she's a very smart monkey, and I'm sure... I'm sure she got it from her parents. Like, I got my mechanics from my father. Oh, yes. Now, um, one last question before you go. Yes? Um, where'd you get that? Oh, my rag? Yes. Well, I purchased it at, um, my father's shop, because he had a shop, remember? Oh, yeah. Yes, I think I said that. I'm not sure if I did, but because I am traumatized from that experience. So, um, yeah, I bought it there. It was the first thing I purchased with my own money, and so, um, yes, yeah, it's a very, very tragic experience. Oh, well, I'm very glad that's treasured, and I'm certainly going to treasure this interview after what happened. Yes, I will do. Well, that was our interview with Ace Fenderbender. I'm very glad I got to talk to you, Ace. And I am too. And, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. And, um, well, yeah, that's it. Bye. Goodbye, everyone. Well, guys, that was the video. I hope you liked it. And, um, um, you can subscribe and comment and like and all that stuff. And if you want to watch more videos, you can. And we have a lot of Lucy playlist that will be in the top of the end screen up there. Yeah, right there up there. And then, um, if you want to, um, follow us on Tumblr, D, or Instagram, please do. And I'm not camera shy. Bye, everyone. Now, this is Julie out. Julie? What was that?